In our college, it is told that if we have two batteries and we want to connect these batteries in series, then what we will do with positive terminal of one battery, connect a wire and connect this wire with negative terminal of other battery. And from positive terminal of second battery, connect a wire with the load and to this load, provide negative power supply directly from the negative terminal. It means we have to connect negative terminal of one battery with positive terminal of second battery. With the remaining terminals of battery, connect the load. By doing connection in this way, it will be series connection. And if we connect two batteries in series, like if we connect 12 volt and 6 volt battery in series, then in this condition, load will get voltage of 18 volt. It means according to all diploma books, we can do the connection in this way and we can run the load. Only thing we have to keep in mind is operating voltage of our load must be 18 volt. But this answer is not absolutely correct. What is the actual answer I am going to tell you? Suppose you have two batteries and their voltage are different. Now as you know, rating of this type of battery is in AH. Suppose capacity of this battery is 10 ampere R. It means it is a battery of 10 AH. For now, suppose from this battery we can flow maximum 10 ampere current. Besides, from this battery only 5 ampere current we can flow. Size of battery is different, so current rating will also be different. Now by keeping in mind the current rating of bigger size battery, if you try to flow more current in circuit, then in this condition, battery of comparatively smaller size is going to be affected. So according to bigger size battery, we cannot flow high current in the circuit. In any condition, if you did connection of two different size batteries, then in this condition, you have to make sure according to current rating of smaller size battery, current must flow in the circuit. It means in this circuit, maximum of 5 ampere current can flow. If I try to flow more current than this in this circuit, then in this condition, this smaller size battery will be badly affected. What all effects will be there on this battery? Let's understand this. First effect will be on the discharging of battery. Suppose this 12 volt battery and this 6 volt battery are connected in series and a load is running. To run this load, current which will flow from these batteries will be different. Like from this smaller battery, high current will flow and from this bigger battery, low current will flow. Suppose 10 ampere current started flowing from the battery, then in this condition your battery may become faulty. Besides, your battery will heat up and due to this battery may get burned. Second problem which will arise is, in this smaller battery, there will be deep discharging. It means discharging point which is there in battery, like this battery here, we can only use this battery till 80%. But if you connect these two batteries in series, then you will discharge this battery even more than 80%. That is, till 90%, 95% or even till 100% you can discharge this. Due to this, battery will become completely dead. Now besides in this 12 volt battery, there will be less discharging comparatively. If I want to charge this 12 volt battery, more voltage than 12 volt I need to provide to charge this battery. Now if I want to charge only this battery, then for this only 6 volt voltage I will provide. I can apply 7 to 8 volts also but cannot more than this. Now you connected these two batteries in series. So to charge these batteries, what you will do, at this point you will connect a wire and connect second wire at this point and your voltage will be of 12 volt. Now through 12 volt power supply or through 18 volt power supply, if you try to charge the battery, then in this condition your battery will get overcharged. And if your battery get overcharged, then heating issue will be there for sure. Along with this, chances of blasting of battery will be increased very much. Now if you connect two batteries of different rating in parallel, then the main problem here is potential of this bigger battery will be too much high and potential of this smaller battery will be very low, that is voltage will be low. Due to this, this bigger battery will start charging this smaller battery till the point where voltage of both the batteries will become same. That is, equal voltage of both of these will be 9 volt. So always remember, if you want to do series connection of batteries or want to do parallel connection, then always use batteries of same manufacturing company which will be of same voltage rating as well as of same ampere R.